Hello friends, welcome to Glade Pixel channel with another new tutorial. Today you will be learning that how you can do separate an image from the background or how you can create a transparent image. As you can see in this image, there are many tools but today I will be using pen tool in this tutorial. So let's start it. Well this is an image of a little girl. So I am going to cut out this image from the background. So first of all we have to find out the point where from we want to start it. You have to see that where from do you want to start with your pen tool. So let's take a pen tool. Zoom in your image. I am going to start from this point. This is the table. Keep in mind that your selection should be slightly inside the image. The purpose of using pen tool it crops beautiful images with sharp edges. Even sometimes you can't guess either it is original or cropped image. It was actually filling the white color in my shape so I have reduced the opacity. Now it is zero opacity. So idea is when you are cropping with pen tool when you click somewhere and the next point is slightly round so what you have to do just click and drag it little bit drag it outside or inside so that you can create a curve there as you can see i clicked and didn't leave it as it is just drag it out a little bit slightly drag it like this and when you click and drag it it creates two handles and uh, with both handles you can set your selection for example you clicked on wrong side where you don't want it to select or where you don't want it to click so you can set them with your handles and these handles will be created only if you will drag your point after clicking when you click somewhere and don't leave it just drag it Let me cut out the hands and again table has been started. Well selection has been completed of this little girl. You can see we have an extra layer when we started our selection a shape layer was created. Now we don't need this shape anymore just press ctrl enter and select your image layer not the shape layer. Go into select menu and select refine edges. Here you can see a few options smooth, feather, contrast, shift edges. But before using these options we have to see what is the quality of our image. You can see our image is already very smooth. Now I am only touching smooth option and the value is 1. Press ok. Go to edit menu, copy and paste so now we have transparent image but you can notice still we have a gray area between the ear and 
hairs now we need to remove this make selection with your If you forget to select some part of your image so don't worry you can touch them at the end of your editing it happens sometimes we forgot to select some important area so we don't need to worry you can do a lot of things at the end of cropping now the selection is done again hide this shape layer and select your image select your define edge option you can see the only selected area is visible again we have to do same just to give When I put the dark background behind this girl image, you can see a little whiteness within hairs. And let me remove this. I am touching it with the stamp tool. I need to touch the edges of the hair. Now you can see it were white slightly from the edges, but now it's dark. Wow, it looks perfect now. Thank you very much for watching this video. Keep watching, keep sharing. Don't forget to subscribe the channel and press the bell button so that you can receive the new videos notifications timely. Thank you very much. Bye.